The exterior alone is enough to make even the most hardened criminal run away, trembling with fear. Massive gates, gothic stone, and six dizzying levels of diabolical steel bars and dilapidated cells. The way it looks is just, it's creepy and amazing and so old. Perfect for a paranormal plot and horrifying new Hollywood attraction. It's an actual haunted facility, so uh, that's just uh, the big bonus. For special effects legend Robert Kurtzman, his artists, however. So they're all uh, kind of freaking out about like working in solitaire by themselves, you know, dressing the set. The scene of countless tragedies since 1886. That's actually what uh, helped end up shutting it down were the inhumane conditions. Mansfield's notorious Ohio State Reformatory. Long before Andy Dufresne got busy living in the Shawshank Redemption shot here, real inmates were dying. Tortured souls, now institutionalized, says Executive Director Paul Smith. There have been some folks here that have come out with scratches on their backs, their hair pulled, things like that. Throughout the massive property, which houses Old Sparky, Ohio's historic electric chair. There was 315 people executed in that chair, and the youngest one was being a 14-year-old boy was killed in there. At just 18, auto theft landed Mike Humphrey in the reformatory. We had one fellow, I guess he set himself, all, set himself on fire in one of the cells and burnt to death. Um, I think another fellow hung himself. Spirits that sometimes attack, says Mike, who was eventually pardoned and is now a tour guide. And all of a sudden he went, ow! But most menacing is solitary confinement. Supposedly pretty cruel down here. Where inmates beat a guard to death. And just like the movie, Give them another month to think about. some lived in total darkness, while others were snuffed out. For a while, they experimented putting two inmates together in solitary. When the one strangled the other one, that was the end of it. But the beginning of the paranormal penitentiary. Please! God, I love you. Uh, this is uh, Monster Clay. A haunted attraction being created by Robert Kurtzman for the upcoming Halloween season. You know, taking on a project like this is like taking on a film production. His impact's immeasurable on hundreds of movies. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> With a twisted talent no, for all things terrifying. No. You like scary movies? Uh-huh. Do you have nightmares? I don't have nightmares. <laughs> but he enjoys dreaming them up at his Creature Core studio in his hometown, Crestline, Ohio. Yeah, I grew up, you know, watching movies when I was a kid, and that's how I got into all this stuff. <laughs> now designing new maniacal monsters for the reformatory. Just bigger set pieces and, and bigger creature things going on, more creature experiences. <laughs> blood-curdling characters that, for the first time, can touch those brave enough to purchase a special pass. You wear something that uh, allows the actors to know that these people want to be messed with. All other plans for the reformatory are top secret, except to say, if there are ghosts, even they might be running scared. Oh my gosh, it's, it's above and beyond. It's, it's things I've never seen or heard of before. Plus the paranormal, I mean, it just adds an element of, of Real terror. In Mansfield, Suzanne Stratford, Fox 8 News.